Okay, we're gonna do the 19 round drill again with the Hellcat. We've got the Swamp Fox Sentinel Red Dot on it. We've got the Night Vision, lower one third co-witness sights, which actually are like lower one fifth with the Swamp Fox Shield for the Sentinel. Really good, really good setup here. Got the TLR7 sub, Apex trigger, but I have put the factory striker back in it because with this Palmetto State Armory AAC 124 grain 9 millimeter ammunition, I have had two light strikes in 200 rounds. Both rounds went off on a second strike, but uh, I want reliability, not just uh, squishy triggers. So it's all right, it's broken in. We're well past the thousand round mark now. The only thing that's kind of shitty is this half of the dovetail on the night vision sight broke off. She's not going anywhere though, but I don't know what the happened the hell happened to that. It fractured and yeeted itself off. So, oh well, we're gonna go from a draw and we're gonna work from left to right and then right to left. It's going to be draw, one, two, three, back to 20 yards, one, two, three, back to 30 yards, one, two, three. Reset the plate rack out to 40 slash 45, hit three times, run back up and finish your six. Ideally, you make 18 shots, 18 hits, and you have one in the pipe that you don't have to use. So we're gonna see what happens here. No timer, just going when I'm ready. It's about breath control, trigger control, and hand-eye coordination, and try not to get distracted by birds flying around because I'm a waterfowler and it's March and I love watching the reverse migration. So let's get at it here. One miss, got a lock back on the 18 round, extended. 19 round drill, you only miss once. That's pretty good. All right, let's try this again. Gonna do it the last run for the night with the Hellcat. Here we go, hands up, threat. Screwed that up, but I still made a hit. Ooh. Missed. Ooh. Missed twice. Sucking, but this is why you train. This is why you train. I'm just happy I got it perfect, well, near perfect, on my first run. One thing I do not like about this dot, there is a drastic difference between the lowest two or three settings and the middle ground. It's like it's missing a brightness setting. So if I have it bright right here, it's just fuzzing out the entire plate at 20 yards. But if I turn it down, it's, it's there, it's precise, but it's hard to pick up quick. Click, jerked it, yep, empty. These Hive technology ex base plate extensions, they give you 18 rounds. You have to stretch the magazine spring, and after about eh, a half dozen to a dozen cycles, they just unreliably lock the, uh, the gun open. Sometimes it does it, and sometimes it doesn't. Feeds reliably, but 
Not something that I would start off in the gun for defensive purposes, but I do still carry one spare or both spare 18 rounders. Review coming soon, guys. Just playing around tonight.